So let's get this garden tour started, shall we? All right, y'all. So we have our catnip that is doing well. In fact, I got a couple of long limbs off this week, and I'm drying them for Casper to enjoy. And then, y'all, this basil plant just keeps on getting bigger and bigger again. So I'll probably trim this top part this sometime this week, just not yet. And then the other basil is also doing very well. Not quite ready to trim, but that's okay. And then this poor little mum. Something has gotten to it. I have a feeling it's some moths, so I am probably going to end up getting rid of it. And replacing it with a new mum I saw at the grocery store I'm gonna be going to this weekend and then let's get over here in the middle because our garden has just grown so much so we have our first red celosia just doing so well and our pepper plant is just getting better and better every day and then here's our yellow celosia. It's got a little baby celosia coming off of it. And then y'all, this jacaranda tree just keeps on growing and growing. In fact, if you look up here, it's growing some new leaves. And then, oh, there's a Casper cat. Hello, Casper. How are you doing this morning? Did you go get you some breakfast, sisters? Huh? Did you get you some breakfast? Hello, sir. <clears throat> Casper. Psst, psst, psst. Hello. <laughs> He's just going to keep licking his chops and enjoying the cool weather. It's actually cooler today which is nice and then our calendula is doing great in fact we have more buds getting ready to bloom and I already picked off a bloom for this week it's just doing well and then here's our pretty currant bush still doing great you can tell it's just about ready for that cooler weather and the leaves will start to fall off but we will have had one two three four five six seven new branches this year so that's awesome and it does really well during the winter it winterizes well outside so i don't have to worry about it and then they're pretty hummingbirds I love it because every night I get to come out and see all the different colors they turn. And then here's our purslane. Probably get some cuttings off of it today. And then our beets are still staying in there. And then y'all, the pea plants, all four decided to come out and say hello this week. So here's two of them. And here are the other two. And then we've got some carrots that pop through, y'all. I put two carrots in each spot. So whichever one does the best as it keeps growing is the one I'll keep. And then here's kind of my contraption for the pea plants to just grow up. And then what I'll do once they get up both poles then I'll put a pole across the top so they'll be all set and then here is our last red no our next to last red celosia the biggest one yeah these are pretty much done on top so the ones that look like they're dying out I'm gonna go ahead and harvest today and then let them dry out so I can get the good seeds from them and then here is our clover doing so well keeps producing more and more filling up that bag and then here's our next yellow celosia doing well and our aloe 
is doing good. And then here's our last red celosia, still doing so well. Lots of little extra flowers on each end of the plant. And then here's our last yellow celosia. Also lots of little flowers on each end of the plant. So let me turn you around and we'll wrap this garden tour up. Alright, so as you can see, it's been another great week in the garden. Just can't believe how well everything is flourishing and doing so well. And things are starting to get ready for fall, which I'm excited. I love the cooler temperatures. We're still supposed to be a little hot at the beginning of this month, but that's okay. It's just the way it goes. But I hope you are doing well. Hope whatever you're working on is being blessed and growing well and as always if you like this video hit that like button and if you haven't subscribed I'd love for you to subscribe and join my journey and I will see y'all this weekend for the final <laughs> August adventure video y'all it was just so busy last weekend I just couldn't get that done I'm still editing I've got music to add and then it'll be ready so maybe this afternoon we'll see but y'all have a great week